Last week we shared some of the amazing things that are happening across our primary schools and this week our secondary schools are in the spotlight. Whether it's creative arts, performing arts, sport, social justice or partnerships with community, we really have seen our Sydney Catholic Schools values in action over the past couple of weeks. Out at Freeman Catholic College Bonnie Rig Heights, Year 7 student Ben Stabilly has been selected as Michael Banks, a lead role in the Sydney Lyric production of Mary Poppins the Musical, which will run for the next few months. Ben also appeared in Sydney Catholic Schools production of Fame Junior. What a star. From the performing to the creative arts, and Tatum O'Connor from Mount St. Joseph Milpera is a finalist in the Young Archies exhibition at the Art Gallery of New South Wales. Tatum's work titled Feeling Blue was also the winner of the SCS Portrait Prize and the Executive Director's Award, so you obviously have a bit of an eye for art. Could be my next career. In the sporting arena, Sydney Catholic School's new system-wide approach to secondary sport has seen the completion of the basketball, touch football and water polo seasons and the beginning of the winter season with netball, football and rugby league well underway. With 38 secondary schools competing across four conferences, the talent is limitless and the competition hot. Let's head over now to St Ursula's College at Kingsgrove. And this week, the senior leaders introduced an initiative which promoted environmental sustainability. The students put the principle of always wishing you had someone else's outfit to the test by opening the Urshie's Op Shop. Students donate clothing to sell to one another and raise funds which go to St Vincent de Paul. Any items that are not purchased are donated to Vinnie's. What an amazing initiative. It was quite a spectacle on the street outside of St Patrick's College Sutherland this week when a crane loaded seven demountables onto the back of flatbed trucks to be driven to flood affected Trinity Catholic College, Lismore. The donation of the demountables is part of a push from many Catholic schools across Australia to support a community that is still much in need. Connected Catholic communities indeed. And finally, we are so proud that this week it was revealed that St Clare's College Waverley Principal Miss Kerry McDermott was named one of Australia's most influential educators of 2022 and she appeared on the front cover of The Educator. The award recognises educators who have an impact in creating a reformative teaching and learning culture. Well done Kerry. This is just a snapshot of some of the great things in our secondary schools, whether it's an individual achievement, the work of a class or a whole school coming together to support another community. We're incredibly proud of the initiatives we see in all 150 of our schools every day. God bless.